Hi everyone, welcome back to the craft room. So today is my memory book Monday and this is continuing to show you what I'm making for a little baby boy book. And I wanted to do uh, the first year so there are 12 pages in the book. So the last video showed what I'd done with the first three signatures and this is showing you a bit more. So uh, this page is a simple pocket and flap. On the other side, this has got a little magnet. I'll need to remember and cover that up. This is just a pull out book. And so there are lots of spaces there for journaling and putting photographs in. So that is that page. Then this page is a belly band. Um, I'm doing it this way. So remember the pages are open at the side. This page will fit onto the spine. So I wanted to make the belly band so it didn't either fall out the bottom or uh, out of the book. So that's why I put it top to bottom, but of course you can put it side to side. This is a double flap and pocket. And we have another double pocket here, followed by another interlace book. For the baby books, I really want to give a lot of space for photographs um, and things. So this is just an interlaced gatefold. Again, plenty spaces for things. And then just two brads and a couple of punched circles. It, what I've done is I've actually glued two circles on top of each other just to make that more sturdy. That's a double pocket. And then I have done another pull out booklet and this is for inside back cover. Now, let me show you the actual book and what I've done to it. So I have put the front cover on, which is a plain blue backing paper. And then I've cut a large frame out of this speciality paper from Tonic. I've used that on the spine and on the back it is pale blue. I did think about maybe putting the center of this, the center piece on the back. So that is what I've done so far. What I can do while I'm on actually is I can just start putting these pages in to show you how I do that. So we have to make sure we've got the right side up. And for this page, we have a pocket, so we want to make sure it's the right side up. And we want to slip that over. I'm just going to check and make sure that I don't need to snip any off. OK, so what we need to do here is get the tape. I'm going to have to move you. Sorry. There we go. We're going to tape on each of these spines. Now, when we put the page into the book, we do not want the page to go right down to the bottom. We want it to be more at the top of the spine. So we're going to put the tape along the top of this. And we are going to put this on both sides of each spine. So let me just do one or two just to show you, rather than have you sit and watch me do the whole thing. So we want the tape on both sides here. But as I say, focus on being closer to the top than the bottom. All right. Now, remember, I'm obsessed with bubbles under the tape, so I want to make sure that I 
uh, get all the bubbles out of the tape. This can be quite footery, but it is worth getting it done. Take your time and do it properly. Okay, so we have it. We're going to hold it so that it is not down, falling down against the cover. I'm going to hook that out just a little bit. And then we will hold it and pull and then smooth it all the way along. Okay. And then we're going to turn it round here and this will be easier uh, just to hook this, pull it out and then press that down. Okay. Let me just do another one. And then you'll see it all coming together. So again, we're going to put this as close to the top of the spine as we can. And the same on this side. squint this one doesn't matter as long as it's at the top and not holding the page at the bottom so that we can move it okay push it down ah. now here is our next page we want to check that it is the right way up. We've got a double pocket there. We're going to slip that over the spine. And then we're going to very carefully hold it in position. And then hook that out. Maneuver it, push it down there, pull the tape out and then secure it. Okay. Second side, always so much easier. There we go. So I am just going to continue inserting my pages. Um, the next stage for me will be to do the front and back inside covers. We also then have to do the inserts, the photo mats, the, um, you know, little cards, stamps, things like that, that we can insert into the pockets and into uh, the belly band and things like that. So that's what we're going to be doing next time. So I'm just going to continue putting all of these in. You'll see the finished thing next week. And then, as I say, inside front and back covers and then the photo mats. So that's where we are with this baby book. It is coming along fine. And uh, I hope you like it. Please feel free to comment below. And in the meantime, stay safe and warm. Take care now. Bye.